Okay, that's bad. Um, we're focused on power, kids, but there's only four days worth of food, so, you know, that. Raka has hypothermia. We're all gonna die here. Good morning, everyone. Dave from the Wee Hours here, back with some more Stranded Alien Dawn, where we're hoping for a little bit of peace and quiet around the colony. We had a bit of an issue last time with these guys, the Draka. They were eating our crops, and we went to go hunt them, and they didn't like that. So they attacked us, and Nova got really banged up. She was actually in danger of bleeding out. We fixed that problem, but now she's got an infection. So I need somebody to go and deal with that. We do have some medicine. We don't have no medicine. Han or Zonder, you, you guys would be good with that. Zander, you're not really doing anything right now. Can you go heal Nova, please? Grab yourself a med kit. We've only got the 10 of them that we crashed with, but we've got them. So we may as well get that infection taken care of there. Han's a little better at doctor. We know Nova is injured. We have researched wind turbines. So despite the chaos, of last time, we have researched how basic power works. So we've got a lightning rod up here, which doesn't really do anything at all right now, but we've got the concepts of basic power down, so we could do power poles, wind turbines, etc., etc. Can't do anything with that though, because we need metal alloys. So we should be, if we've queued this up right, yeah, we're working on metal refinement. So we're going to get ourselves a little furnace, we're going to throw some scrap metal in there, and that's going to make metal alloys, which is what we need to construct any of these power devices. Uh, Xander, did you get over and uh, cure Nova? Where, where are you at, Sparky? Where, where are you, Chief? Oh, you went all the way up there to get a med kit? Why? Why are they up there? Have we not moved those at some point? Wow, you are... Well, you're on the... Oh, you're coming back down here. You went off to go do something else, didn't you, Xander? You're very silly sometimes. Ooh, animal migration, though. A large herd of animals, the Olfin. Now, we know these guys are basically completely placid. Absolutely no chance of them trying to come and attack us. Where are they in relation to us exactly? You said in the area. They're not... They're not that much in the area, are we? Because where are we? We're way over here. Okay, so they're kind of in this direction. Actually, wouldn't mind grabbing some of that skin bark. We're growing it, but it's growing a little bit slowly. Okay, let's just hunker down. Let's let's hunker down here. Uh, oh, Xander's up in Doctor. Good job, Xander. Uh, you know what? I'm going to increase your, your thing on that then. Uh, if you're that good at it, why don't you be more prioritized in it? So I've got some ideas. I've got some plans here. First things first, I'd like to move the lightning rod sort of, I don't know, over here. Because what I think would have been a smarter solution to the animal eating our crops problem that I have probably got tagged for in the comments. Again, I do record a lot of these in advance. I'm having a ton of fun playing Stranded Alien Dawn, so when I'm done with one recording, I do generally just sit down and do another one. So your comments are very welcome, and I do read each and every one of them. Unfortunately, I'm reading them in the future, sort of in the, well, in the past. I'm doing a bit of time traveling, so I'm sure many people popped up and said, hey, stop the animals eating your crops. Why don't you build a fence around the farm, you moron? And we got some options, too. We could do a scrap metal fence. I've got a fair bit of scrap metal, but wood I can just keep getting, and they have the same integrity. We've got the poles. We could do... Ooh, those are better. Better. Yep, diverts most animals from their path. That's quite a bit more integrity. It's more wood, but I can get wood. Diverts most animals from their path. And most animals again, but this is this is going to stand up to a lot more abuse. I bet the stone one does even better. Yeah, st actually, stone one is the same as the wooden poles. Let's keep it homey around here. Let can I put this right on the edge of the farm? Not as such. Okay. Let's. Uh, I just want to see how fences are going to work here. So I'd like this to go all the way down here, like this. Yeah, like way way down here, and then to here. And here, and here, and here, my weird little farm here. All the way, you know, bring it all the way down here. This is going to chew up basically all of our wood. Hmm, I should put a gate there to account for the fact that they're not going to be able to get in there. Okay, uh, let's do a gate. Uh, gate, 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 fence gate. There we go. Oh, hang on, fence door. 
wonder which would... You know what? I'm just going to do both. So I'm going to put one there, the fence gate, and then I want to put... Talk to me about the fence door. What does this do for a living? Uh, sure, a wooden one. Okay, so that's just a little thing down there. All right, put two of those up. That's going to chew up basically all of my wood. So let's just get some of these earmarked for demolition. Nova, did we deal with your problem here? Your uh, infection? It looks like we have. It looks like everything has been treated and I don't see your infection thing popped up anymore. Okay, good. You'll heal up eventually. Boy, you really got wrecked in that. You really, really got destroyed in that. Uh, old equipment, yeah, lots of stuff is breaking down. Everyone's going to have a meltdown. I'd really like to get to the concept of some power around the place, but we need that furnace up and running. I feel like this fence is going to be an issue. That might be a pathing issue. Well, you know what? We'll find out tomorrow morning. And as usual, Raka is doing everything around here. All right, right into the construction there. I do need you to get back on the research game when you're done with this, but you're pretty good at construction. You're going to throw this up very, very quickly, and I want it up anyway. These guys are totally eating our crops, and I'd rather not risk hunting them again. I mean, they're placid if you just leave them alone, but boy, you put a few bullets into them, and they get very, very fussy. They really don't like getting shot with lasers or pulse rifles or arrows or anything at all. The fence looks very good. I'm liking the look of this fence. I should probably put another door over here in the middle just so they can get in and out a little easier. I don't know. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Now, Xander's starving because he won't wake up and get himself something to eat. That's, again, you're a very, very silly man, Xander. This is, yes, there you go. If you're hungry, you can get up and eat something. Ignore that. Raka just vomited on the floor there because, um, well, you know, food poisoning and whatnot. So ignore that. That seems to have taken care of itself. How's the fence coming, kids? Okay, I mean, it's in there. It's getting done. Things are happening. Yeah, we'll have this done very, very shortly. And then I've got another plan. I want to set up just a very small structure here that's going to be a new bedroom for Xander. Because when we finally get power and refrigeration and freezing done, I would like Xander's room to be the freezer. Oh, hang on, we got bugs again. Yep, the bugs are coming. Where, where are the bugs in relation to us? Uh, they're kind of far away. They're kind of far away. Actually, they're not that far away. We've scavenged this, right? Yeah, we've totally scavenged this. Oh, they're fighting with the Draka. They're, they're fighting with the Draka. The Draka's fighting with them. Okay. Well, let's let the Draka do some of the work then. No need to rush in. If, how's, can I see how the Drock is doing? Oh, it's bleeding out in 11 hours. Okay. But it's taking out a bunch of bugs while it's doing it. Yeah, you go, Draka. You get in there with that. You get those bugs. Yeah, bad bugs. Get those bugs. You're totally going to die, like, wicked soon. Nope, it's running. It's running. But it's taking the bugs with it. So if the Draka can get far enough away... I might solve my bug problem in the fact that they're just not going to be in the area anymore. Yeah, they are. Oh, no, some of them are still here because they just ate a tree. They like eating trees. They're into that sort of thing. Okay, how are we doing? Where'd the Draka go? It's running. I mean, it's going to be dead soon because it's bleeding out. No, unfortunately, they're coming back to their original location. That's less good. Okay, and they're pretty close by. I think we're going to have to get the team together. Thankfully, Nova is healed up again. You are miserable right now. Absolutely miserable. What are you doing at the moment? What are you what are you up to these days? You're sitting. Okay, you're probably going to, looks like you're going to go in and have a snack. All right, when you're done with your snack, we may go on a murder bug hunt. And how about we close the gate? How about we close that gate? I probably gate was not the best idea. I probably should have done this as the door. I think that's going to open and close by itself like the other doors do. Okay, are you feeling better? Uh, not as such, no. But you're becoming more relaxed, which is good, because we're going to go on a hunt soon. Where do those guys go? They're sort of... Yeah, they're up in here-ish. I don't suppose these bugs would like to get in on those bugs. If that would solve a bunch of my problems right there. Everyone's kind of taking a nap. Except Xander, he's up at night. Uh, where are you going, Nova? Okay, you're just kind of hanging out, going for a little walk. Alrighty. I actually don't want to hunt them. I'm looking for a little peace and quiet. Uh, Nova, could you actually go close that door while I'm... Yeah, handle that, please. Could you handle that? Okay, we're under attack. We're under attack. Uh, it's probably Nova. Are you... Yeah, you, um... You kind of wandered into their area there. Why don't you hustle back here and then everyone else come on out. Xander, bring the pulse rifle. 
Uh, Raka, you know what? I don't want to get you injured, but why don't you come on out as well? So yeah, everybody get over here, please. If you could hustle a little bit. A little bit of hustle there. There you go. A little bit of hustle. That's more like it. Uh, mostly Nova. Yeah, Nova, if you could come back down here. Are you actively being chased? Oh yeah, you are. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. The Draka are running. That's totally fine. Uh, you guys, come up here. And then you should be able to get some shots. Who are we missing? Xander? Oh, you're all the way over here. Why are you all the way over here? What were you... I must have sent you to scavenge something, I bet. Okay, well, we'll just deal with these guys for right now until Xander gets back in. Uh, we're missing a lot of things. Okay. I'm re mostly relying on Han here with the laser pistol. Okay, we're getting some shots in there. Things are sort of happening. Um, Han, why don't you back off? And then no, oh, Nova, Nova, Nova. I can't, just don't get injured anymore, please. Yeah, go to the spear. Go to the, or, or not, you know, that's cool too. Whichever you don't want to do, that that's fine. Go to all of that. Han's getting swamped right now. Rock is actually better at combat, that's cool. Yeah, Nova, get in with the spear. Good, good spearing there. I like, I like what you're doing with spear these days. Uh, you're in with the knife. I gotta get you a spear or something. Uh, and then if you could get back on the laser pistol pretty soonish, that'd be cool. Uh, no, hitting things is better. There you go. There you go. Okay, we're all set. Uh, Xander, don't bother. We're done. Yeah, Xander just showed up. Just sh good one, Xander. Yeah, dollar day late and a dollar short. Uh, you're all you're all undrafted. Yeah, may as well butcher a few of these. Go ahead and get that done. Okay, who's injured with what? What are your problems? You are a little bit of bleeding. You're going to be broadly fine, and you're going to be broadly fine, too. I'll get Xander to come in and take care of you guys soonish. We should have plenty of bandages kicking around right now. Again, a little peace and quiet if we could get a couple of things done. I'm not even asking for that much game. Really not that much. Just enough to get the refinery thing down. Okay, Nova's back up and running, and Xander's in to go bandage up Han. So this should be totally fine. Captain Han will be fine. You were doing a little bit of research. You're up to like 50-50 on metal refinement there. Quick bite to eat, and you were just complaining it was chilly in here. Okay, that's not good, although it will help the food if it's slightly refrigerated. That's not the worst thing. You're back into research. I might just pin you to that research desk, Raka. I'd really like to get the metal refinement under control. Yeah, you're going to butcher all of those animals. That's good. I told you to do that. Xander's having a meltdown. He's going to go wander away for a while. Good one, Xander. All right, there we go. Sitting on that research desk, we've got metal refinement up and running. So production, furnace, yes, please. Some sticks and some stone. I've got just enough stone to do this. Not a lot of mining opportunities around. Haven't found a lot of stone, but if somebody wanted to get into that, we can start making some alloys. Now, having said that out loud, can I spot any more stone around here? There's probably an overlay for that. In fact, I'm pretty sure there is an overlay for that. I'm just broadly ignoring that overlay. Again, we yeah, we have totally salvaged that. Don't keep coming back to that thing. And while I'm up here, I'm just going to tag some of the glitter caps for harvesting because we... We could be doing a little bit better on food. We're not starving. It's just that most of our food is rotten. Ah, you got a nice collection of animals over here. Now, you guys explode into toxic goo, but you are completely placid. Hunt you from a distance, no problem. And you guys are placid, too. I wouldn't mind getting that, because then we could get some leather. I'm going to tag you guys to be hunted. Retaliation chance, 3%. I'm, I can, I'll bank on 3%. The Draka are 15, and that's a much higher number than 3 in the grand scheme of things. Not a stone in the area. Not one. There we go. Okay, found a big old patch of them right here. So let's mine that one and mine that one. Uh, we can't get into that big one, but we can get these guys out. All right. Uh, who's queued up to do mining? Is that, that a thing? Everyone. Okay, everyone will do mining at a nominal level. Now, what's going on over here? What do we got going on? Have we put anything in here? We have put some sticks in there, just not some stones. And it looks like rock is on that. You're going in to get those rocks and deal with that. Then I'll queue up a whole bunch of metal alloys. We should have enough metal scrap to at least make something. So how about you try and keep 10 of these in stock at any point? Like, just try and keep 10. 
Uh, not ten times. I want... Oh, can I only do it? Can I not set this up to be a permanent thing? Hmm. Interesting. I can on everything else. And I can smelt things, too. Raw ingredients into refined materials. Okay, well, we'll, we'll definitely have a think about that. Uh, but mostly just try and get some alloy. You know what? Try and no, no, no. Come come back to this, please. I, I want to do it again. Ah, there we go. There's my intel. Um, until we have 20. See if you can get 20 metal alloys. Uh, thunderstorm, that's fine. We've got a lightning rod up now, so hopefully nobody's getting struck by lightning. Nova, I see you're off hunting. Okay. That's that's a thing you're doing. How's it going? You getting the thing killed? Oh yeah, you're doing it in the middle of the night and this thing is a complete tank. You're going to be here for a while. I'm just keeping an eye on Nova in case that 3% chance of retaliation ticks off. She's getting it done. It's happening. Bleeding out in less than an hour. You only got 25 health left. The bow doesn't really do a lot of damage. But it's all we've got right now unless we scavenge something better like that pulse rifle that we picked up. Uh, you are dead? You're dead. Okay. So you're going to go butcher that and deal with that. Hopefully that'll be some hides too. I'd like to see that coming in. Uh, Han, what are you up to? You're just chilling out. Just hanging out over here. Okay, cool. What do we got queued up on the stove? Veggie soup. We're waiting for somebody to do it. Meat soup can't do apparently. And grain porridge, we don't have grain. That's fine. Oh yeah, the uh, lightning rod just got struck by lightning. Great. Doing its job. Now, what I'm obviously seeing is that we could connect this to a battery of some sort, and every time it gets struck by lightning, we charge up the battery, up along with whatever other power we're going to get going. Have we made any metal alloys yet? Waiting for ingredients. Okay. That's probably a delivery task, I would imagine, right? Deliver is hauling items, material, to storages, and devices. Okay, so it's got to be that. Um, Han... You don't really have any planting going on right now. Why don't you be a little more hyped up about delivering things to things? Han's doing great on moving things around, not as much about actually stocking this. So yeah, could you go do that, please? Is that a different task than delivering? Is, there, is that crafting? Is that producing new items on dedicated devices? Maybe, maybe. Well, he's in there anyway. Oh, and you picked up that meat too, good. Yeah, you don't, if you're not hunting, Han, you don't actually have a heck of a lot to do. So why don't you be my dedicated hauler? Yeah, a rock is going to have a meltdown. We're all having meltdowns. It's a terrible time in this colony. 42%. Okay, 48%. Oh, this is going to go up very, very quickly. And this is going to unlock some stuff too. In fact, it just did. There we go. Just as I'm talking about it, this has unlocked the wind turbine, which is exactly what I wanted. Well, I mean, amongst all the other many, many things that I want. One electronics. We've got that. We've actually scavenged quite a bit of electronics. And this is going to produce 40 energy. Okay, what I'd really like to have is a battery. So where... I know that's in science, obviously. What are we... Yeah, we're... Oh, wow. We're already up to 73% on, on refrigerators. That is fantastic. Oh, we lost... We lost some... Uh, some plants there. Oh, that must have been the glitter cap that I told them to go get, and apparently we, we didn't get that. That's okay. Everything's fine. Uh, while I'm doing lots of things, focus, focus, focus. Okay, let's put up, how about one wind turbine? Just one wind turbine could go live somewhere. I feel it should live by, the, oh wow, there's only four days worth of food. Okay, that's bad. Um, we're focused on power, kids, but there's only four days worth of food, so... You know, that, Raka has hypothermia. We're all gonna die here. Okay, who's supposed to be in charge of cooking then? I feel like this is something we should have covered, guys. Who's into cooking? Uh, not uh, Han, because he hates it. Anyone else? Anyone else can do this. Xander, why don't you be number one on cooking? And then how about we harvested this area? I know it's not 100% done, but let's harvest it. And same with this. Again, it's not 100% done, but let's get it out of there. We need the food right now. We do have... We just hauled in a bunch of meat. Do we not... Can we not eat this? We've got a lot of dried meat here. I, why Why can't we cook this in here? Meat soup? Yeah, make make more of that? I don't know. Just make some... Make something. Okay, and it's snowing. It's snowing, right. So it is... It is definitely winter. We are in fall, moving towards winter. I have no heat for any of these people. Nothing. I have one torch on the wall. Did we get... 
Light and heat. Show me light and heat. We've got a heating stove. That needs more metal alloys. What's the heater do? That just takes a small amount of metal, metal, metal alloys, rather, and will give us some heat. How am I... Okay, first things first, kids. Probably close the windows, huh? It's snowing out. Why don't we close the windows, please? I'm going to put, I think, Han on number one on handling. So if you've got a window to close, go close the window. We've done refrigerators. That's fantastic. That's actually the exact opposite of what we need right now. Uh, we're getting some more alloys out of here. Yep, 91%. Okay, that should not... It's not quite going to be what I need. Maybe I should just make another furnace and kind of be two-fisted doing this. Yeah, we've lost some more things. Okay, this is all... I'd like to say this is all fine. Oh, we did get the windows closed. Great, good. All right, yeah, I like that. Han on number one. If you got to go close a window or open a door or something... Now, you guys can't get in here, can you? Ha-ha! I foiled you. You're trying to destroy my fence, though. Could you not? Could, wait, 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 wait. What are you fleeing? You're fleeing that guy? Really? No, we're not fleeing that guy. We're gonna shoot that guy. Yeah, you better run, buddy. You better run. Where, where'd he go? Okay, leave him alone. Leave him alone. He's run away. We've accomplished the mission there. Yeah, we've damaged the wood fence. Oh, the, the animal is... Who's attack? Oh. I'm really getting to dislike these guys. This, this is just not working. I don't like these guys at all. Uh, Nova, we're all coming out. We're just going to deal with the giant bug problem. Yeah, they're smashing our fence. This is no good. This is no good at all. Come over here and then shoot from there. Yeah, you stay over there. We'll stay over here. And hopefully no, no, ne never the twain shall meet, as they say. Yeah, you're getting stunned by the pulse rifle, which is exactly what I want. Good. You're dead. Where's your friend? Over here. We're, we're just eradicating this problem immediately. So you, you are going to get shot a bunch. You won't quite be in range of the bow yet, but you will be soon. Yep, there you go. Yeah, you don't like that at all, do you? And now you're perma-stunned from the pulse rifle, so we can just sit here all day and take shots at you. Yeah, animal attack. Good luck. Oh, unless it's that guy, in which case I'm very, very worried. Okay, you're running. You got a little unstunned there. You're running. You know what? You're going to bleed out momentarily. Okay, you're done. Where's your other friend? Yeah, we are... This is an extinction-level event around the old colony here. Stop smashing my stuff and eating my crops. I put that fence up for a reason, and it cost me research. Okay, I think they're broadly all done at this point. So let's undraft everyone. Now, don't even be telling me we don't have food now. Okay, we got a lot of food here. Butcher all of these things. Oh, are you technically still alive? Yeah, no, somebody go slaughter that thing. Okay, you're gonna, like, bleed out. For, yeah, peaceful. You ain't that peaceful, are you? Yeah, I'm going to put up another... F Wait, I don't have the stone for that, though. I'll put another furnace up sort of in embryo, and then maybe we can do two-handed smelting here, because it only makes ten at a time. Ah, you're making food. Good. Food is good, and you're frantically making food, too. Good. I like that. It's frantic because I've got you in high speed mode, but frantically making food there. I just want to see... Now, what is... The refrigeration thing. Where does that live? A floodlight. Oh, that sounds good. We should get one of them. Not right now, but we should get one of them. Uh, storage? A fridge. Okay. Stores. Oh, it, it's just like a thing. Oh. I thought it was like going to be RimWorld-esque like air conditioner unit. But it's an actual... It's just a fridge. Great. Uh, then I could put it in here. Oh, this is much better. Like, it's an actual, just a regular old fridge. It's going to block access to literally everything. I'll figure that out in a sec. I'm going to open up this room. Um, what's... No, we're not exploring today. Hot air balloons are amazing, but not, not today. Uh, how are we doing on our thing here? Are we... Yep, we just figured that out. Okay, stop. Slow down there. Slow down. Let's get... Are we already making more stuff? We are waiting for ingredient. Okay, great, cool. 
Somebody will get on that. I'm going to need more of it anyway. So Han, could you just refuel this one more time, please? There we go. Thank you. Now, what exactly is it that we do here? So a power pole. Uh, metal or wood. I don't really care. Uh, that needs metal alloys. Well, now I care. So you're going to go from there to there. Now, can I stretch you between those two buildings? Not quite. But I could get one here. Oh, I've got, I've got to remember to hit shift on that. One here. And then one, yeah, like here. And I think that is going to, like, power up that building because it'll be in range. I don't know. I'm messing around with this as much as anyone else is. So here's what I'm going to shoot for. I am going to empty and deconstruct all of that and put the fridge there instead. And see if that that is going to solve a lot of my food issues. Obviously, it will be refrigerated, so food will definitely last longer. Oh, wow, you already put up that first power pole. And that does seem to trail right to there. And then this guy is going to trail right to here. You're going to throw that up. Yeah, you're basically doing that right now. Got some more metal alloys coming in. I kind of need something a little more hyped up on mining. And also, by the way, butcher that thing, please. Is that another one? Is that a live one? Do you see what happened to your friends? I'd walk away if I were you. What are we researching right now, by the way? Ah, energy storage. Great, there's my battery right there, but it's going to be those metal alloys. That's the thing that's going to hold us up. I would not be opposed to finding a new ship piece to scavenge. How about this one? Have we done this one yet? Yeah, we already did that one. That is unfortunate. We're going to have to travel pretty far to get anything. What about this guy? How about you? Yeah, scavenge that. Might be something else good in there, too. You know, like another pulse rifle or a laser pistol or something. While we're here, get this. No, no, no. Just the skin barks, please. Somebody go cut that. I know they've got eight trillion things to be doing right now, and we can't do any of this this quickly. But I'm giving it a shot. We're, we're getting into power. Power technically exists. In fact, can I see how much you're generating? You are producing 36 out of 40 per hour. Okay, not connected to a power consumer. You will be. Don't worry. Why are you bringing food over here? We shouldn't be allowing food in there. Raw insect meat. That shouldn't be in there at all. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. No raw food. No cooked meals in there. Insufficient storage. There will be soon. I'm putting up a fridge. Don't worry about it. I just need them to finish deconstructing this. Uh, if you could... What are you transporting now? Because I just... No, that's a floor. That's different. Han, I specifically told you... Oh, you already did it. To put some more scrap in there. Are you already on the case? Good. And are we deconstructing this? No, we're just throwing up. Okay. All right. Got Nova taken down the rest of this. So can we now... What was that under again? Storages. Can we now put up a fridge and will it work? I know we don't quite have enough materials yet, but we will pretty soon. So I'm going to put that up there. And then we're going to kind of see what happens. Uh, how far off are we from that? Actually, I've got 25 metal alloys there. How much do I need for this? This is going to be fine. Raw food and cooked meals. Yeah, exactly what I want in there. Okay, we only need 20. We should be able to slam this thing right up. I'm going to increase the limit on the furnace as well, so we can just try and get more of this done. But I think we're going to have enough to put up our snazzy new fridge here. Now I just got to figure out the other thing, heat. How are we going to get heat to go? How is that going to happen? And where are we at on batteries? Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Could I put up another power pole, uh, say, here? No, not quite there. Not quite there. It's blocking. Blo I could put it up there, but that doesn't connect to the other thing. Hmm. Could I just get it to go like that? No, that's not going to work. But that little underground line certainly seems to tell me that's going to power that building. Okay, I need you to go... I might have to shrink my farm. I think that's what's going to need to happen. I'm going to need to shrink the farm a little bit. Or, there are only 10 wood apiece. I could just go around this building and do it that way. Let's do that. So back to power, back to power pole, back to wooden power pole. And this is going to go, how far do you stretch? About there-ish? Okay, one there. And then one go, I'm going to go over here. That will connect to that building. Well, let's put that guy... Oh, not quite there. I'd kind of like the power lines to be in a line, because that's me. And that'll connect all the way down there for a potential heater. And on that, let's put in some vents. So, a vent there, 
and more more vents, please. Heat and heat and light. There we go. Heat and light. So let's get one. Oh yeah, I put a torch up there, didn't I? Um. Okay. Broadly fine. Broadly fine. Not really as fine as I'd like it. Spin you around here. Yeah, the torch is gonna have to go. Except not, because I'm gonna put. It has to be even. It's just. It's a thing. All right, so put that there. There we go, there we go, vents. And then I'll put a heater in like the middle room and hopefully that'll get the heat moved all around. Right up until we got meteor rain. Meteor rain. Of course, what is your problem? Hang on, what's what's the problem with Han? What happened? You're, you're fine. You are basically fine. You're in perfect physical shape, in fact. We've always said that about you, Captain Han, and your amazing laser pistol. Did you just... Oh, you've got a breakdown thing. You just sort of... fell over... in your meltdown. You just decided to crash out for the day. Okay, you're probably going to want to get up, Han, because meteor rain. I was just getting some things done today, too. And then... meteor rain. Uh, we got more bugs, and it's the scorpion kind, too. Not cool, because Captain Han is out to lunch. And I kind of need the laser pistol... But it looks like they're coming in for the attack. Han, could I... Really, man, could you just kind of get it under control, please? Where are you these days? You're still over here in bed. Great. We're going to be attacked and we're all going to die, Captain Han. Thank you so much for your contribution to things. I'm going to back the team off because the bugs are pretty far up here and they're not really moving. They're just kind of hanging out over here. I'm actually kind of hoping they'll get struck by a meteor. Speaking of which, is that one of the meteors that just crashed? It's an interesting rock. Okay, well, we're not going to observe it right now because there's a dangerous murder bug here. But we might poke at that in the future. I know I've already salvaged that thing. Ah, Han's back up and running. Excellent. Ah, uh, where are you going? Wh where are you going? Xander, where are you going? Are you just kind of wandering around? Oh, you're having a sad wander. Great, you're having a breakdown too. Uh, neat. Don't wander too far up here, man. Not not really too far up here. If you, if you could probably help that. Maybe, okay, you're going to totally, totally get encountered by the murder bugs. And then you're going to freak out, and then you're going to run away, which means we won't really be able to target them quite as well, because you're going to lead them on some sort of insane Benny Hill chase. You're going to walk right into a murder bug. Oh, you've turned around. Good. Okay, one of them found his way around here, and now he's attacking the fence, which is less than ideal. Uh, Nova, where are, where are you? Why are you over there? Okay, can you kind of get in on that? Why don't you come around here? Join the team, if you will. All right, yeah, the bug sees you. The bug's probably... Oh, the bug has a projectile attack. Oh, goody. The bug, like, spits acid. Uh, Nova, the other team is here. So come on in. Xander, I could really use you right about now. Like, you and the pulse rifle would be super good. Han's injured. Great, neat, cool, loving this. Yeah, these guys are not to be played with with that projectile attack. Okay, we got him. We got him. How banged up are you, Han? Yeah, you're bleeding pretty bad, man. You are bleeding pretty bad. I'm going to undraft you and let you guys get back to whatever it is you were doing. There's still four of them out there, but I don't want to keep hammering at those guys. We got to get better defenses. Ooh, the Draka's in. The Draka in the... Oh, the, the Draka took one down. Thank you, Draka. I might not exterminate you the next time you come to my farm. Oh, and the fridge is up and powered. Up and powered. Great. So at some point in time, when Han gets back to active duty, he'll probably start moving all of the food in there. Oh, this is going to be good. This. How much does this store? Ooh, only 20? Or is that by type? Can I get 20 types of food in there? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. It's taken up 8 power, but we produce that. We're fine. I think even if we have minimal wind, we're still going to be able to account for that. And then we'll increase our power as we go along, because we need to get the heat up as well. Oh, Xander's found a problem. Xander's found a problem. What's your problem, Xander? Is it a giant murder bug? Did you poke your nose into the giant murder bug nest? You did, didn't you? You did. Um, I'm so sorry, Han, but we are going to have to get you up and running here. And also Nova, and also Raka, because Xander just kind of can't get his act together today. Raka, could you come anywhere, please? Draft you and bring you over there. Yeah, uh, Xander's having a really, really rough day today. 
And now you're going to do the Benny Hill chase thing again. Oh, everyone's got to get up here. Everyone's got to get up here. Xander, the next time you flee from danger, could you flee towards the people who are trying to help you? I'm just putting that out there as an idea, as a concept. Because now our most valuable person, Raka, has got to deal with all of this. And there's more of them, too. There's, like, way more of them. Okay, Nova's coming in. We'll get some more shots in there. All right, acute pain. I'm so sorry, everyone. I'm so sorry, everyone. We've got one more. One more to go down. Come on, guys. Come on, Xander. Xander's back. Great. You want to come in on this nonsense, man? Get over here. About time you got showed up. Okay, that was apparently the last one. Everyone's got to go get healed now. Uh, obviously, Han, you are most le Wow, you are really bleeding out bad, man. Uh, you gotta go rest, like, immediately. Go... Oh, that's Nova's bed, sorry. This is your bed. Go wait for that, like, right now. Thankfully, Nova, not injured. So Nova can hopefully deal with this. If you could move a little... I know you're horribly, horribly injured, Han. If you could move a little bit... I know you're bleeding all over the place. If you could move a little bit quicker, that's gonna get you treated more quickly. Just saying. Uh, the Draka are back, and they're, for some reason, really angry with us. Is it because I exterminated your entire family? You know what? Take out the fence. I've stopped caring about the fence. If you want to go in and eat our crops, you go in and eat our crops. I basically just got to get people healed up here. Um, yeah, Nova, if you could... Why are you halfway across the map, Nova? Why did you do that? So long as they don't attack us right now, I'm, I'm letting them slide. If they just want to, you know, do their thing here, that's fine. You want to eat the crops? Eat the crops. I should just put out... Hang on, this isn't the worst idea I've ever had. What if I just put out a random thing of crops out there for them to eat? And then they could come in and eat those crops and not bother our crops. Yeah, they run away when we show up. They're not attacking us. I, I hope. Uh, okay, could you not attack my lightning rod? I'd appreciate that. Okay, can we save Han's life, please? All right, Han is patched up, but we got to keep this going here. If you could actually heal Raka as well, and then I'll send you over to deal with Xander. He's not on my, he's not on my Christmas card list right now, but we will get you patched up. Tiny little bit of pain, got a little bit of a puncture. In fact, if you heal that off yourself, I might not bother. Now you are bleeding. We're going to have to deal with you at some point. Sorry, Nova. I know you're desperate for a night's sleep, but we've got to get this done here. You're also ravenously hungry. Are you off to go eat? You're off to go sleep. Yes, sorry. If you could actually just deal with Xander before you go to bed, that would be great. Nope, she fell asleep outside. She's out. Yep, couldn't do it. Couldn't quite get over there. Okay, uh, Rock is going to have hypothermia. We are working on a heater. I know, I know it's been a long time coming, but we are working on a heater here. So, how much heat is this going to put out? That one versus that one. This consumes sticks, but takes more metal alloys. This consumes power, takes mess, less metal alloys. You know what? Eat the crops, Chief. You're fine. Eat the crops. I'm okay with it now. Just go ahead and eat them up. Now, we're going to have to take them out again. They're just wrecking everything. I'm just going to... Just for giggles, I'm going to see if this works. So I'm just going to put up a very small grain cob farm over there. And you guys can go eat all of that that you want. You can have it all. Yeah, I know. They're trashing our fence. Um, Nova's back up and running, so I've sent her over to deal with Xander here. Um, what are you What are you off to go do, Han? What are, you, what are you doing right now? You're fleeing. Okay, good. We're, we're scared of these guys. Oh, no, they took out my power pole. No. That is no good. Is there like a scarecrow or something? I... We gotta... Okay, team. Team. We're going to exterminate everything that lives on this map that I can see. Any Draka is dead. Okay? And I was gonna give you your own plot of land over there. You could eat that all day. All for the Draka. No, no, no. You had to go and get all aggro and take down a power pole. So, you know what? You get shot in the face. You know what I do like about combat in this game is I don't have to tell them to move if their thing runs out of range, if their target runs out of range. They will just automatically go and move around to a more uh, obvious location to start shooting things. No, no, no. Uh, just shoot it, please. We're going to exterminate all the Draka. 
all the Draka must go away now. We've dealt with most of them. They've trashed a lot of stuff. The fences are down. The power poles are down. My lightning rod is down. That is a hit. We were just getting power under control there. Now my fridge is going to be down. Are we done? Is there any more Draka? Anywhere in the vicinity? No? Okay. Let's all get back to work, shall we? I am going to set up to get this insect observed, though. We were told we needed a dead one, and we've got one. So let's go ahead and observe those scorpion kind of things that came in there. All right, we'll get all of this eventually back up and running. Let's see how long it's going to take them to do that. Also, Nova, we've never quite gotten around to healing Xander. You just threw up in Xander's room for reasons I can't fully explain, but go ahead and heal him up, please. All right, the heater is up and running, but not enough power. Okay, not enough power. So they've fixed everything. Everything is back up and running. The lightning rod, the power of thing, imajiggy, all of that stuff is here. Okay, how about if we put in another wind turbine, like right here? And Raka is about to die of cold. I don't, I don't have an awesome way of fixing that, man. I say that. We've had tailoring ready to go for ages. How about a jacket? Would you like a jacket? A fur coat. And I can probably make some of those too, yeah. Um, do it like four times. Let's all get a fur coat. Raka, you can have the first one if you survive that long. I'm not I'm not actually super confident on that if I'm honest about things. And I am. Are you off to go do that now? No, you're doing other things. Okay, it's not life-threatening anymore though. You're you're gonna be fine, man. It's just just um I don't know, run around or something, work up a sweat. Yeah, actually, if you want to build this, because then we'll have enough power to power the heater. And your room will be nice and warm. Won't that be fun? So those things are apparently a shrieker. Absorbs collagen and calcium and transforms them into sharp spikes. Yeah, we noticed that. Yeah, did you not mention it spits acid or something? Okay, tear flesh with the strong jaws. Yeah, those guys suck. We don't like those guys at all. How's the uh, new wind turbine coming up, kids? You are working on... What are you working on again? Oh, okay, yeah, batteries. Yep. Ooh, the fridge. The fridge. Oh, yeah. That is much, much better. Oh, this is going to be good. Okay, now we got some food. It's refrigerated. Obviously, it's going to be in there for 36 days. Meat soup, eight days. Uh, these guys will be in there forever. So the glitter caps will last forever in uh, refrigerated conditions. Dried meat, 96 days. I can cope with that. All right, food, definitely back on track now. Ooh, I don't know what we were scavenging, but we scavenged a synthetic helmet. Neat. Uh, did we make, slow it down a little there, did we make the fur coat? Is that something we can have? That's a jacket, yeah. Uh, oh no, you've already got a jacket. Do you want a, a fur coat? We haven't, have we not made, oh, you're having a freak out. Never mind. You can't do anything at all. Um, no, we haven't apparently made that yet. Are we working on it? Uh, what, oh, I'm looking at the wrong bench here, Dave. Are we working on it? Not enough resources. Oh, okay. All right, we can we can get on that. Let oh, rock has fallen down. How about we did a little bit more cloth? Yeah, if we could get a little bit more of that, that would be good. We'll need some more cloth or cloth scraps. Um, Han, would you like a really cool hat? No, because we haven't brought it home yet. Okay, the new wind turbine up and run. Oh, you guys are back. Are you serious with you? deal with you in a second. Does that mean, therefore, that the heater is working? It not enough power? Really? You sure about that? This is all one big... Yeah, this is going into this building, right? Is that, isn't that how that kind of works? Consumers. Yup. One heater and one fridge. How much is the fridge consuming? Oh, it does consume a fair bit, though. Zero out of eight per hour. I feel like I should have enough power for both of these. And that's zero out of four. And the wind turbines, each wind turbine is producing uh, like about, oh, eight out of 40, and then eight out of 40. Oh, not connected to a consumer. Okay, how do I, how do we make that happen? I thought you were just going to kind of fall in line with this one. I'm not immediately sure how to fix that. But I'm going to put up a power pole here to connect to the wind turbine, and then that will connect into the other 
uh, chain of, of power poles here. There's probably a way more efficient way of doing that. I'm just not really sure what it is. I kind of assumed when I put this one up, it would just sort of auto-connect. Actually, can I do that? I thought it would auto-connect into this one. I don't see a way for that to happen. Copy it, turn it off. No, I don't want to do any of those things. That's a terrible idea. But that's probably an excellent place to call it on Stranded Alien Dawn for today. Got a lot done. We've got refrigerated food, and we have the idea of heat. Heat is coming as soon as we get all this power hooked up. But we've got electricity. We're doing things now. We need some more metal alloys. We need to keep the Draka out of here. We're going to look more defense next time. Maybe some turrets, so they can just get shot in the face every time they poke their nose into my space corn. But we'll pick up some more of Stranded Alien Dawn next time. Hey guys, if you enjoyed the video, do please leave a like down below. It does cheer me up. No end when people do that. And if you're new to the channel, maybe just checking it out for the first time, feel free to hit that subscribe button. See more of this ridiculous nonsense. Until then, I'm Dave. Thank you, as always, for joining me in the wee hours, and we'll see you next time. Oh, what is that? That's like a person. Oh, hang on. Da -dum. Ah, uh, what are you doing, Amanda? What are you up to? Are you f are you figuring out how cows work? Because that's the wrong end of the cow. I assure you, Amanda. Citizens Tropico, everything is under control. This is this is not a fire. This is not a fire. This is an aggressive urban redevelopment program. I have a cylinder. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. I, I broke Dave. <laughs> broke Dave. <laughs> uh, talk about yourselves on the back. <laughs> I just dropped my controller. <laughs> oh my goodness.